already a Minty Mouth breeder. Just want to say thank you very much for waiting for part two of this derelict production. Also, I'd just like to thank all you guys for heading over to our brand used website and buying a flag or shirt or sticker or some damn thing. And last, but certainly not least, all you Minty Mouth breeders to come over to the Patreon, I appreciate it. All you guys that decided to stick around, appreciate it even more. And just a reminder for all you Minty Mouth breeders that were wondering where the uh, Slave Lake videos and all the greasy stuff went, well, that's where they're hiding. Well, without any further mouth breathing from me, enjoy part two of this derelict production. Your tongue must be hung in the middle so that it can waggle at no. both ends. And Alrighty, well she's been burning under there for a solid, oh, 20 minutes meow. And you can tell it's working. But what for it's dripping like the old lady watching an Aaron Tippin concert. And the oil pan is nice and warm to the touch, so let's go up in the cab and see how she cranks. Alright, well you heard how slow it was cranking before. What for uh, being right frozen. Let's just hear how it cranks now. Still cranking pretty slow. We're gonna go ahead and just let her sit for a little longer and uh, warm up a little more. Add a few more logs on the fire. It's nice and warm down here, it's beautiful. All right, so we're actually getting two bird stone with the same joint here. The exhaust manifold being that the fire's on this side, it is nice and toasty warm. So that's good. So any exhaust valve that's been left open, all that heat's just gonna rush into the top end. All right, and you can tell by the valve covers starting to sweat there, it's starting to uh, heat the top end pretty good. So uh, yeah, let's just, let's go in there, give her a quick snort of Cosby sauce and see if she fires. Uh, it's not even a cold start anymore, it's cheating. All right, we'll grab the Cosby sauce here and give her a little snort. This air intake on this thing sucks. You have to nail her right in this hole here. It's gonna need all of it. Oh, why is it wood smoking here? Still got the same batteries in it. So let's see if she goes. Clutch. Right to the mat. Oh. Probably gonna need some more Cosby sauce. Come on. Oh, don't wanna kill the batteries now. Let's try her again. Oil pressure. Come on, sweetheart. Oh, not enough cranking power. All right, I might have added a little bit too much fire, and now the tie rod's on fire, but that's fine. You just add a little bit of uh, a burnt fire extinguisher and she goes right out. Let's go swap the batteries out. These rickshaw hoods are just good for this. That electrical stuff is fine. You see that? It's fine. You don't need to worry about that. I mean, by the time we get this battery done up, this thing's gonna be up to operating temp. All right, let's try her again. All right, the whole engine's defrosted now. The heads are all defrosted, everything. Yeah, she should just fire right up. Give her another snort. Man. Let's see what happens now. Still pretty on the cranking. I'm about to put the other battery in there. Imagine that. Half ass and it didn't pay off. All right, out of the second battery. Let's see if she goes meow. The thing's basically hot now. The whole engine's just glistening. Some more Cosby sauce. There, I like that. Why are the batteries even here? That sucks. For sakes. Alrighty, two more batteries. Those things are getting really, really light every time you travel across the yard with them. Let's see here. For creek. All right, let's try her again.
to be reading. Is that a, is that 100 degrees, man? There's no way. Let's engage this hillbilly fast idle here. All right, we'll let her warm up. The governor just thinks, you, you leave the pedal at one spot, and she'll just wrap right to the fucking moon. Oh, I could have used a decompressor. Oh, well, I'll remember for next time. I'll use it twice next time, it'll work. There you go, what did I tell you? thing actually idles. I mean to check that out because it's got to be like 400 rpm. You can't really trust the tack in this truck because she's kind of stunned. It's like the Willard of tacks. Look at that thing. Stunned. All right. Well it's got 60 psi oil pressure. Let's just see if it'll move. fat ass completely forgot to eat you know because uh that's what happens when you get the fiddle in. but the haze is out the uh old cunt worthington she's out and ready for some change what are you ready for some stunned well, he wants some dirty old wings too i'm so hungry i could eat the hole out of a dead moose so i'm gonna go ahead and pick up some wings and get my fat ass back to work probably gonna hydrate a bit too though you guys gotta keep hydrated and i heard his voice saying that's right you ain't going to S-H-I-T right for a month. Alrighty, so since I'm a derelict and uh, it takes me so ever to get anything got done. It was, uh, I think I left off, it was March 7th. Well, it's only March, I think it's 31st or 30th. I don't know, but uh, well, the last time I seen my fat crippled ass was uh, I was in here frying chicken wings in the god frying pan. And the last thing to get fired up was a Catalina wine mixer. Alrighty, well, she's tropical out. It's probably plus five or six. In communist measurement. I don't know what that is in freedom units. She's a muddy show. It was minus 10 last night. So instead of me getting this thing running and fiddle around with it, old sawed off Frenchman says he wants to, uh, you give me four grand for this thing? Uh, I thought it was a hand. Oh, yeah. With your hole, right? That means you're gay. Yeah. Oh, you were asking me about the, uh, how this thing got so up and if I was driving it in here with a flat tire on it. Look at the side of this truck. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All of it. Alrighty. So this was the last one on the list so uh this is gonna be an old star it's been two years since the uh, sexy sister-in-law does a great right minty get their going oh yeah and by the way it has half 1540 and half 7590 for the engine oil so it's good then oh yeah it's mint this is the there's only there. one there's gears in there too oh yeah exactly whatever you stun the last time i started this thing for cold start though it was like minus 40 out oh the spray here now the technique of dual wielding was brought to you by years of spraying ether into sh Oh yeah, that should be enough. No, nope, that's enough. Yeah, that's enough right there. And that's too much. Uh, let's try that out. And it was it fired up no problem. Is there a dipstick over there? Well, do you see any oil on the it ground? On well, do you, is the ground black? Oh yeah. Oh, then it might not have oil in it. We might, <laughs> might have a look at it. Say, hey, would you look at this? So sawed off. I got a question hey, hey, for hey, you. Hey, I got a question for you. No, I got a question for you. What's that? All the dicks? Yeah. So if ether blows up every engine it's ever touched, why would they build this contraption here with a giant can of Cosby sauce hooked right to it? Because these engines love ether. So basically what you're saying, according to all the mouth breathers on the internet, every time you spray ether into an engine, it blows it up, right? That's so right. I noticed that you sprayed ether in that engine. 
Don't you know it'll blow it up or at least become addicted? <laughs> That guy's still a virgin. <laughs> so every time that this thing's been started, they rebuilt it? That's right. Oh, no sh Is that why it's so oily? Or is that just rust prevention? You know, they made this engine from 38 to 96. It might be the best engine ever made. One of the longest built. At yep. 38? Put in the comments if you know an engine's been built longer than this old pile of sh Where the f the god dipstick is? I can't see. What are you stunned? Is it in the doghouse or something maybe? I don't remember. No, I can't find it over here. I don't remember Did where you rally to... out the dipstick? No, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Willard, f off. He's not stupid, sawed off. He's stunned. Willard, are you stunned? Look at that mint trailer up on the oh, dump. Oh, it's still got all kinds of oil in it. Oh yeah, and that's the good stuff too. Man, look at how thick it is. It's not even running off the stick and it's <laughs> plus five. 7590. It's like rebuilding the engine. It does what French people do when they want concrete trucks. I've done some things I'm not proud of. You want me to fluff it up for you? Or you I've done wanna... some things I'm not proud of, but I'm proud of this. You want to do the groundwork and the <laughs> and the shucking? Man, the last person to start this thing was a lot more sexier than you. You want me to get up in there? You've oh, said that to me a few times at get night. Up, get up in there and deep back. Look at that state-of-the-art radio. Man, that thing's just sassy. Should I start it to the carpet? And of course you got to start it to the carpet. <laughs> That's the stupidest question I've ever heard. I hope it blows up when we start it. I'm not buying it. Sounds good. We'll just bring it right to the dump. All right, should we just see if it bumps over? Oh, or, yeah. Right to the woods. Okay, if you don't send her to the moon as soon as she fires, we can't be friends. That's how it works. Oh, hold up. I dropped the ether nozzle. And you big dumb son of a. <laughs> God damn it. All right, give her. Get up a go than that. Granny shifting, not double clutching like you should. <laughs>
get a hundred shot of Nas didn't blow the welds on the intake. How dare you up once again. Shut up, I gotta blow up another engine. Oh, this thing needs ether. So this, there's a button here that says ether starting aid. Is that ether? People stunned. <laughs> well, it cleans right up. It's just, the injectors are just a slobbery hole. Neighbor sent him in the spirit of selling things. You still want to buy that mint trailer I found at the dump? Yeah, buddy. Just dig her in and I'll take her home. Sounds good. Oh, <laughs> I could think of a save the spray for the way back, the return trip. I'll give you your nitrous. Ready, buddy?
Rob, we gotta try to get this tire to take wind. If it'll take wind, we'll just leave it alone. Oh, I think, I think with enough Cosby sauce of the John Deere variety, man, you were bagging it. Yeah, it sounds like it, but I wasn't. Man, when I sprayed the John Deere into it though, I was waiting to get backfired in the face so hard. <laughs> like it was, it ate a whole can while you were redlining it. All right, here, pull that core out. We're probably gonna need. I'll give you some. What's that? We're gonna need what? We're probably gonna need. Uh, I got a cruise control zip tie on this. We're good. Excellent. It's doing Detroiting stuff right now. It's got that water that comes out and it flows on top of the other water. <laughs> <laughs> it's floatable water. Oh yeah, I had to, when I drove it home, I left this thing a little bit because it just makes like 180 piss out of the whole drive. Oh, it's got a regulator. <laughs> yeah, the regulating leak. <laughs> yeah, I can't get it. It's just, it's packed full of ice or something. Well, you, well then here's the torch. You want me to hold it your hand? See, you're more comfortable with this. I don't go underneath shit offended Oh, by it's fine. fine. I don't do <laughs> like dun, that. Dun, 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 dun. That's it, thought off. Everybody's gonna call you a poser now. A <laughs> poser. Is it? I don't think there's much of a gap there. I think there is. I think it's getting in there. You just left. That should be more than enough. Shake hands with danger. You ever, oh, I did, I did, as soon oh, as you started playing. Oh, that, that was rowdy. <laughs> that made my, it made, a, it made an unnatural sound, didn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know what I'm doing here. <laughs> Think so? Oh, yeah. No, I didn't. <laughs> Give her, shut up. Give her. It's going. That wasn't even <laughs> sketchy. <laughs> Yeah, because it was just losing as much. There, that's what I was talking about. Oh, yeah, that's definitely a big rock. Yeah. Oh, it's all burnt black from the <laughs> fucking ether blow. Can so you I'm, use your Leatherman? I'm going to use my Leatherman. Hold that. Look at that. off. What about Leatherman waves? They're awesome. I'm waiting. Does it melt the tip? Yeah, it melts through the other day. I'm waiting. Well, it, it'll do it. It just takes it, a little time. It's not time. doing it. I got a pry bar right here. Oh, junk. You should have bought a Swiss one. A Swiss one? The what, so can, the best. what, so it can be a coward during World War II? There. <laughs> Speaking about cowards, how does it feel to be French? <laughs> oh, it's hey, saw it off. what am I using again here? Using, your using my Leatherman wave. You saw it off. Why do you, why do you have ducks? Why do we have ducks? Yeah. Gotta something. You know that ducks die after they have sex? I've never heard that. Well, the one that I did. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, this is cleaning her up real nice. Thanks to Letterman Wade. Get in there real deep like. Oh, I will. That's it, boy. Get in there nice and deep like. It's perfect now. It's the bead is perfect. No, it's perfect, is it? Like your love life? <laughs> I said perfect, it's non-existent. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you consider charging by the hour perfect. Man, this is going to cost us like literally no book. $15 in ether. No. Yeah. No. It's going to cost a whole can. A can of ether is not $15. This John Deere stuff is. using the John Deere stuff. Yeah, but it's the good stuff. It's 80%. <laughs> Bill Cosby recommended. Why are you back there, man? <laughs> he's not he's our either. It ain't, it ain't near. How much is too much? All of it. All right, ready? <laughs> kaboom! That was a baboom, man. Holy shit. Man, that, 
That was a lot of Cosby sauce in there, but I think we sealed her up. That's fine. I've got the airline on, but I don't know if it's taking air. This is the first thing that you've ever thrown hose at that actually took it, eh? <laughs> well, no, sometimes you just gotta pay. <laughs> that thing in your basement doesn't have a choice, right? You beat it, wasn't You it? can hear all three of our holes, like, ee, ee, ee. Actually, you were my, like, blocker, so I wasn't scared at all. I just I'm glad I could be you. there for you. And then when you come flying, you'll hit me, but I'll still get blessed. Yeah, but if you, you imagine if I exploded so bad, my leg <laughs> shrapnels and just take sod off out, you, if you died of my leg, I would, I would just, I'd die happy. <laughs> but, I, yeah, but I, wa I wouldn't want him to die right away. I'd want him to slowly die because, like, my, like, my fecal, my piss, all the PC light and bush lot, the smell, I'd be like when a tremor blows up. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Smell like that because it's dead? <laughs> <laughs> There's only got flat tires on the back right. Oh, oh yeah, we can get this one back on, no problem. The front left is flat. Oh, that looks f***ing annihilated. That one was dozer deleted. Yeah. Did I? Oh, I rallied into it? Yeah. No, I didn't. Yes, it did. No, it didn't. Yeah. Hey, what year, is, what year is it? 2023, there's no accountability. Not my fault. <laughs> it, it died of climate change. It died of climate change. That's right. You gotta take it for a rip down the road all the yeah, way. Yeah, go down the road. Down there. Am I skinny enough to get in here, Sada? I don't know. The real question is if I get in the hole. Can you get are, back out? Are you able to come save me? <laughs> <laughs> this is safe. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> He's crowning. Well, people go into these things to work on them, so it must be possible. Good thing I'm not claustrophobic. Yeah, me too. Uh, oh, there's a cool in here. <laughs> oh, it's full of con- oh, full of ice. Man, this is cool, man. Looks like your kid's got a new flame gym. Yeah, I don't know how- Yeah, there's no way, that's just only- Yeah, everybody post in the comment section, what the f How thick are these things inside? You're blocking up the light, you fat fuck! I have a bit of a time climbing back out though, but I'm fatter than you. Substantially. I'll just take my leg off and I'll weasel right out. So oh. what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do a start with a header and then go into a full spin. Make sure, <laughs> make sure you land directly on your neck. Luckily, my neck broke my fall. <laughs> to remove all misery of existence. <laughs> you wanna drive a thing over neighbors? Yeah, why not? Wanna borrow with Kenworth? We don't have any Kenworths here. Not enough anyway. Never did determine if that was Chris or not. <laughs> oh, you worthless piece of It's totally out of air. It's either full of air or out of air. Does it need oh, air? Hold it, hold it to the mat. Oh, oh yeah, he needed to release the brakes. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, Can you hear anything right now? No. 18 wheels and a dozen piss jugs. Alrighty, while well, we hauled her down the road. Just a mission friendly. Old Catalina wine mixer, you can live a shot off French. Really? I can't believe the tail 
to work. All right, well, she's a few days later, meow, and the yard is still smoking. And you, guess what? Guess what's still stunned? Are you stunned? All right, there, holes and mouth breeders. Well, I appreciate all you minty pricks sticking around, watching all this derelict garbage. Like I was saying before, the reason I was uh, kind of down and out for a few days because I went into the old an organic mechanic butcher shop combo and had a little work done you know i uh I, I have a vagina now i can't tell you how free i feel now that i've started identifying as a woman but like i was saying before i've been down and out here for a couple of days what for uh getting chopped up at the old organic mechanic but have no worries my fat crippled ass ain't going nowhere that would explain the lash of about uh 15 days 20 days between filming but i mean that's just the way she goes i could have just been in a drunk coma or or whatever the case may be here maybe willard got the back hole and f***ing dropped the bucket on me you never you never know what the f could happen but i appreciate all you f guys sticking around to watch this sh and moreover i appreciate all the minty pricks that are keeping this boat afloat but yeah much like always I'd like to thank all those minty pricks that are keeping this boat afloat keeping freedom of speech paid for for creek all right to start her off we got 10 bucks we got Scott Hester, Steve Renock, Timothy D. Cerez, Tyler Brown, Samuel Howard, Ryan Melichur, Nick Nolan, Michael Snodgrass, Mark Crippled Oakey, Joe Todd, Jesse McKnight, Jacob Fellows, Holden D's Nuts, Jacob Balsack, Franz Malnickel, Frank D. Antino, Eric Luna, Dustin Debu, Diddley Wright, Curtis P. Loved N.D. Is that a neutral drop? What the f talking about crazy mixture colton Corey east salada colton hendel cheap bourbon and bad decisions brent nestle brady clark and bend over <laughs> all righty as far as the 15 buck go we got george j kotcher your bud that's your bud right caden moppus at 1776 what a treat we got 20 buckers we got wyatt duran william yetter snot rod 74 scott kind 1776 santino francesco Chelly, Santino, Francischelli, Rooster 416, Rattletrap Garage, Justin Prime Rose, Harry Nutsack, Cody Randstad, Clarence Shepard, Brian Sutherland, Ben Hameen, Aaron Gray. We got 25 buckers. We got Ken Hagen, Aaron Walker, 50 buckers. Midnight Diesel Production. Is that a Loop Tube channel, bud? HF Montana at $55.55. We got 7.3 bucks. It was 73 dollars. Which probably you didn't have to do that, but I'm sure glad you did matt j venema 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 yeah i'm done and a hundred dollars matthew brock hey buddy thank you very much so even though my fat crippled ass has been dragging ass on getting videos out these minty pricks seem fit to give my hillbilly ass a raise man all right well first on the raise list we got andrew sullivan trevor moore Cody lee hot ass broads and tiny hogs space cowboy amber graham senior no no amber graham again gave me another raise thank you very much colby taylor john M milky john milky michael or zesh Oski. man that's a mouthful alex gerard 772 alan hergott jordan hereford christian jackson matt j vima 73 dollars thank you very much buddy amber graham stephen schultz my firefighter brad kinney p colton hindle matthew mueller richard fukeva riley charles andrew america the free paul morani gmh raw ls steven schlop adam george j kosher george frias dominic r model mac picadio jacob kajila will ferry will hurak daniel hoffman adam smith mr gray ghost rick yem han low clinton moore trevor horn trucker for sterling give me 50 beans thanks buddy scott smith erling but jerks this i'm stunned i can't pronounce that karen eric myers hot broads and tiny hogs give me another raise thanks bud carl wisted millennial trucker bobby jen fair master of none with 1202 treat jose lebron diz christopher ash john beck matthew brock 100 ethan beer 1202 scott hester ghetto bob shane king cody ranstad long dong silver alex sean armstrong beer cosby pork and beans mt dinner red ender is that dinner red error i i'm stunned or this guy's name is stunned i think this guy's name is done alex olson axel olson jonathan fields eric luna james bowman jacob ladita holden rosin alex tyson wilcroft timothy deserez gary potts ryan yard jeremy hogland at 60 dollars hf montana at 55 dollars and 55 cents rick yam at 40 beans sheriff shop dylan johnner and spinkter piston Alrighty, well i just want to say appreciate you guys very much you guys are minty as all
Oh, you guys are about as minty as Willard is stunned. Willard, are you stunned? How stunned are you, though? <laughs> like, you just took the knob, turned it all the way to 11 until it broke off, or what? You're mangy as I gotta give you a brush. And... Alrighty, meow. Well, she's 23.30, April 4th. I wanna get this video up. Just wanna say thank you guys again, and keep on your ass. Alright, struggling.